covered. Tonight, court documents revealing new details in a Northwoods killing. Thanks for joining us. I'm Melissa Langben. And I'm Brad Hanson. We're also learning the victim has now been identified as 63-year-old Susan Reese. We want to get right out to News 9's Brittany Slaughter live in Anago with what we're learning. Brittany? Yeah, Brad, Melissa, Derek Goplin is accused of fatally stabbing his mom at the home here behind me. And as police continue to search for him, we're learning more about what may have happened. Police say they were called to the home for a welfare check around 920 Monday morning. And that's where they found the woman killed. Um, they got to the house and found a deceased female there. Um, at that point, we started conducting our investigation. During that investigation, court records say the suspect was at the home Sunday afternoon. Video surveillance reportedly showing the victim and a child outside the home around 245. And a couple hours later, the suspect and child leaving. Well, that at some point he was at the home. Um, so we just need to chat with him and, you know, get a count, talk to him about the incident or what may have happened there. So then court records say police found that same child wandering a Waukesha motel alone. The five year old reportedly telling police his grandma tried to kill his dad and he told the child to hide and then the dad stabbed the grandma. Um, that we have nothing's been determined on any motive or what, you know, led up to this incident. Authorities have been searching for Derek Goplin since Monday morning. He's described as a 38 year old white male described as having brown hair and brown eyes, weighing 150 pounds and at five feet, 11 inches tall. Right now, we're just we need to uh, find Derek and, and talk to him to see what he knows or what he can help us with. The victim's body is in Madison for the autopsy, but there is no timeline on when the results will be released. And the suspect is considered armed, so if you see him, you're asked to call 911 right away. And if convicted, he could face fe several felony charges, including homicide. Live in Anago, Brittany Slaughter, News 9, WAOW.